Welcome to another episode of Daily Musings from Sacred Ground. Today I'd like to talk a bit about playfulness and humor. Uh, It's part of who we are. (laughs) As humans, as human beings. Sometimes we talk about humor and playfulness as like a defense mechanism, and it certainly can be all that. But today I just want to invite you to remember that it's one of the defining features of us. I'm not sure if oak trees or squirrels have senses of humor, but I know we do. And it's easy or at least possible, far too possible, to slip into taking ourselves so seriously. I feel fortunate that I grew up in a a place, a family with a lot of humor. Uh, Maybe you did, maybe you didn't, but we can certainly try and generate some space. Um, And it is generating space. There's a Buddhist teacher who speaks of um, meditation as spaciousness. And that teacher says that real humor, not the cutting humor where you're putting down somebody else, but real humor is creating a space where there is none. I love that as a definition of humor. And I give you one little anecdote. Um, Story about my dad. Um, This is from when my dad was dying of cancer about 25 years ago. Well, that's there. There's a funny story, right? Um, But my father had such a wonderful, playful side to him. And one day, uh, his grandson, my nephew, Brian, goes to visit him. And Brian, you know, trying to be a good grandson, kind to his grandfather, he looks at my dad lying there in the bed, and he says, Grandpa, you know, I, I recently had that jaw surgery and you look good. You, you, look, you look better than I did after my jaw surgery. And my dad had recently had an operation. He's got the tubes and everything else. And he looks up at his grandson. He looks up at Brian. And he says, that's, that's true, Brian. But you have to remember I'm a lot better looking guy than you are. And that's my dad. You know, just kind of... The guy's faced in the end of his life. And he still has room for play. He made a lot of room for play. I don't think it was about keeping death at bay or any of that. At least in this particular case, I think it was at least partially my dad, my dad saying, this is who I am and this is who we are. There's room for play. There's room for humor. Somebody said, I can't remember if it was Edward Hayes or John O'Donohue or Howard Thurman or somebody else, but somebody said, (laughs) this life is far too serious. 
to take it seriously. I'm Michael Malley, and you've been listening to Daily Musings from Sacred Ground.